There's a lot of topics today. I don't know if there's a real headline here today. The Astros did get Justin Verlander from the Mets, so back with the Astros. And yes, the Mets are going to pay part of the freight, just like with Max Scherzer. Here is Max Scherzer on what he thought the plan was with the New York Mets. The team is now uh, kind of shifting vision and, and that uh, they're looking to compete uh, now for 2025 and 2026. Uh, and that, you know, 2024, there, the, it was not going to be a reload situation uh, in New York and that it was going to be more of a transition. Um, I said, OK, you know, that's a you know, brand new <laughs> brand news to me, um, different than what I'd ever, ever heard out of uh, Steve's mouth. I was like, all right, I got to hear this directly from Steve. So I had a phone call with Steve. Um, and he basically articulated the same uh, vantage point, that that was the new vision for the Mets. Uh, and so once it became the, you know, official, that's the vision for the Mets, um, then I said, yes, I'd, I, I will waive my uh, no trade clause of that, Under, underneath those pretenses. Okay. I give the owner credit. He tried. It didn't work. And these were commodities that you would be using in October. The reason why you get Scherzer and Verlander is come playoff time. It's not about the regular season, but the team failed. He tried. They spent a lot of money. It's kind of hard to throw these things together and go, make magic. It doesn't happen that easily. I don't care how good you are and how much money you spent. They tried. Didn't work. And now you reload. Max Scherzer, okay, you got your answers. And then he decided that he'd be willing to sign off on a deal. Go to the Rangers. All right. That's how it works. Not everybody can be in it and uh, you know keep putting money out there. They spent a lot of money on that roster. Look at the Padres. Still waiting for them to be elite. Now, we saw glimpses of that last year, but this year, they're average. It ha- The Yankees, average. Now, what do you do this next year? That's the key. Do the Mets spend a little bit? They did get, you know, some minor league prospects here. Doesn't feel like this owner wants to build for the future because billionaires don't like to wait. They don't normally have to wait. They want to buy their way out of something, and it didn't work. But uh, you had some teams involved in the trade deadline. The Yankees didn't do anything. I think that surprised a lot of people. And some just standing pat saying, uh, hey, we have the team. I like this philosophy with the Yankees. They didn't do anything. Yeah, we're fine with who we have. Okay. Good luck with that. I don't know if it's worked the last couple of years where you go, yeah, we're fine. We're going to stand pat here.